Hey, what's up? It's Stephen A. Williams, uh, president and founder of More Lead Steve and the Credit Repair Shop. Uh, com and Blue Book MKE. Everybody wonder how can you run all of these businesses? Well, I have people in place uh, that take care of stuff, but the things that I do take care of, and that's what I'm going to talk about in this video. And I'm like this because it's Sunday. I just finished my workout, having my cool off period to cool down. And it's something that I uh, do on Sundays. I'll read, watch some uh some things on business building or motivational uh, uh, audios or lessons i'll listen to them and uh it's all in preparation to what i'm about to share with you right now is to be successful in your business you're going to have to put together your follow-up uh process and if you've been watching my videos, I talk about using an autoresponder, and um, this is where you can communicate with your list the way that I'm communicating with you right now. And every Sunday after I do my workout, uh, while I'm listening to those audios, and after my reading, I'll uh, uh, I'll put together my list of my uh, emails that I'm going to have for the whole week. Now, I could do this for a month, two months. I can schedule it all out, but this is something that I've always just wanted to do, and I still do it. I haven't passed it down to any employee to do it, and that's mainly because when I was trying to build uh, my businesses to where I could really grow them online, uh, using technology. This was something that I wanted to do. I wanted to do the advertisement, which is, I do all of my advertising for all my businesses. I wanted to have that that job, so to speak. And then on the other side, I wanted to look at the results from the, the advertisements and make uh, decisions on how we would move forward in the weeks moving forward. Uh, I'm pretty sure at some point I'm going to hand that down to someone, but I just enjoy doing it because I like seeing the results of what I've put together from the advertisements to getting the leads to seeing how those leads start to convert as we move them through our uh, uh, pipeline. And um, so what I do is every Sunday is I put I have a list for all of the businesses and it's from the leads that came in and I will send out emails to all of those lists and I will look at the results of number one how many people open the email because the first thing is are people even open it to, to look at what I have to offer and then from what I had in those emails are people clicking to go through to whatever offer I'm sending them to it could be where I'm not selling anything it could just be pure content what is the percentage uh, of people who are going through to watch what I had to offer and I can tell you from experience this is from from anyone but I'm telling you this because this is important because a lot of people don't tell the truth about what they're actually doing in this they're just coming up with stuff trying to sell you things I'm telling you when you send out email this is this is the, this is what happens to your list Depending on what you put in that subject line, you're going to have a certain amount of people that will click and open up your email. And it's always going to be a lot lower than the amount of people that you sent the email to. Now, there's some where you can put a headline and a subject line and you can get a lot of people to open it, but that's going to go with testing. The next thing is a lot less people are going to click through from your email this is for anything and uh but people will make you think that everyone who opens your email is going to go through and click and go see what you had to offer it doesn't work that way but i could tell you over uh for let's just talk about with uh my credit repair company which I'll, I'll use that as a huge as an example for a lot of stuff and the reason why is because it is very difficult to sell someone credit repair services 
before people get into the business, they think that it is something that is easy. Like everyone has a credit issue. Uh, there's millions of people who have credit repair problems. And so if I start a credit repair business, people, I'm just going to automatically sign up customers. And it don't work that way. As a matter of fact, my other businesses that I have, it is a lot easier to sell people uh, what we have. And there's a ton of competition in those. But in the credit repair business, there's a lot of skepticism. So when I show you how to, to uh, you know, make sales with utilizing the uh, what I do with the credit repair business, it will actually 10x what you're doing in other businesses because it's done that for me and my other ones uh, because skepticism is not out there, even though the competition is out there. So uh, what you have to do, is, well, what I do is I put together my uh, list and I'm going to say for the different services or products that I'm going to offer for the week. And it's, used, it's the same ones. I just put them on a rotation throughout the week, but I'm always going after my main product. So with my main product, with the credit repair services, the, uh, let me, I want to pull up real quick. I just want to go over the numbers for, and what I did is I, I, I put myself, which is my automation as an affiliate for my own, uh, products and services so I can track them. So I have my reps that work with the credit repair company. I look at what they do for sales and then I look at what my automation does for sale for sales. And I can tell you every month my automation beats the reps. And I'm the, the, the one big reason why is because automation never stops. People have to sleep, people have to go home, people have to rest automation does not so let me uh look at what we did for automation and i'm going to pick for the month of july and we just hit out august 1st today but for, so for the month of july let's see what automation did for me for just my main product this is not talking about any of the other products or services that I offer. So with automation, with automation, my, whoa, I mean, I, I almost doubled what my top representative with the company did. Uh, with automation for my main product, I did 69 sales. So we got 69 sales times 584. This is for my main product. So just for my automation, I did $40,361.55. That's where people signed up and they didn't talk to anyone. They didn't talk to anyone. They just went off of the email and then clicked open the email, read what I had to say, and then click through to see what I had to offer. Those sales ended up being worth $40,361.55. So that's why I like doing this. I like seeing this. I like putting these, uh, these follow-ups together so I could see what those results are going to be, especially at the end of the month. So what I do is I uh, put together, depending on which list I'm gonna gonna uh, put an email for, and a lot of them are repeat from before, uh, and you could do this too. Uh, but so I'm gonna put together an email that's gonna have a nice headline. I'm gonna put together in, in that same email a nice uh, message and then a call to action for them to go through and see what I had to offer. And you can see for the month of July, without talking to, you, to anyone, my automation made over uh, $40,000. So now I teach this in my program. Uh, there's a link below this video where you can go and you can uh, 
look at my three steps to local and online business success I walk you through how to generate leads because the first thing like step number one is you got to get something that's going to be generating leads if you because if you don't have people to talk to uh, the whole thing just won't work uh, so I invite you to go click the link go check out what I had to offer and then uh, I think that you'll be happy if you decide to uh, get with that program because this is exactly what I utilize every single day every month since 2008 to build all of my businesses I've used this same system and uh, it really does work so hey I'm gonna end the video here uh, happy Sunday this is Stephen A Williams and until next time thank you